Hey, happy Monday, everybody. How you guys doing today? I'm going to take you on a random, just kind of out and about with me today. Um, I've got a bunch of packages I'm taking to the post office for you, for everybody who purchased from me. Thank you, thank you. Um, I'm going to go to Nordstrom's Rack because I actually um, tried selling this and it didn't sell. It's a brand new Longchamp um, backpack. And so they have one that's exactly like this, but it's in a color chalk and I really, really like it. So I'm gonna see if they will exchange this and um, I'll keep it. And then also I thrifted a Patricia Nash wallet um, a couple days ago. It's so pretty, it's called the Teresa or the Teresa. I'm not sure what it is. It still has new with tags. But I noticed when I got it home that the um, it's from Marshalls and the this thing, security thing is still on it. So I got to go to Marshalls and uh, get that taken off. And then it's really cute though. This wallet is adorable. So turquoise is one of my very favorite colors. Actually, they call it aqua on the on the website and these are over a hundred dollars right now. So I'm super excited. Brand new with tags. Um, yeah, brand new with tags. Original price on this was 119 So, I am going to take this to Marshalls to have them take the security tag off. And, yeah, that's what we're going to do. Post office, Marshalls, Nordstrom's Rack. Ooh, I wonder if I see the, um, nah, I'll just go to the post office. You know what, wait a minute. I think I will wait the post office truck is the little postal truck is coming and I'm thinking instead of making a trip to the post office I can just wait here for him or her hopefully it's her because she's much nicer than the than the him dude we have we have a postal worker that's a real boof he's a he's a monster he's mean oh no I think it's him if it's him I'll show you you guys I had to actually report him um, because he was taking my packages and like throwing them full-on throwing them in the back of the truck and not scanning them in and uh, I actually had a couple packages lost from him if you're one of my customers you'll know that we had to file a couple different uh, missing package reports because this guy never scanned them in and who knows what he did with them but he's still working for USPS so I think it's him I'm not a hundred percent sure I'm trying to tell, I'm just gonna wait here for a minute and find out. If it's him, I'm going to the post office, but if not, I will go ahead and get all these. Let me show you all the packages I'm sending out today. See that? that big gigantic savers bag is full of your guys' purses and wallets from my last purse sale. So let's go, you know, I think I'll ride down the street and we will see, let's see. You guys can see the little blinking lights down there. Ooh, if it's him, I swear I know I'm gonna keep going because this guy's, he's so mean. I know my seatbelt's not on. I'll put it on in a second. I love my tree line street, you guys. It's so pretty. Big tree arches over the whole street. Okay, so I'm gonna hold on. Put you right here. Ooh. Okay. Who are ugh, oh, FedEx, you're getting in my way. Oh, it's wait, is it the girl? Oh yes, it's the girl I like. I'm going back. She's so nice. I'm gonna like turn back around. <laughs> oh you guys, I'm crazy. It saves me a trip to the post office though, you know? And she's super really nice. She's like my favorite. All right, moving along, moving along. FedEx, go away. You're in my spot. Just kidding. I won't hit you, FedEx man. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna stop over right here. Chasing her. Here we go. Oi, go, 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 car, go. 
Let the break off, Cam. Oh, sorry guys. Like, I'm really trying to do this here. Okay. Hi, I have a um, bag of packages, but not too many today. Okay, yes. No trip to the post office. Yes, 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 yes. Going to the post office it can be a real pain in the jugular. Um, because if you've been there, you know why. Especially now that it's getting closer to the holidays. is bad. Whoa, there's another um, truck. I wonder if there's a nice guy driving in that one. Okay, if so I'll I'm gonna turn you off if my camera falls down because I just have you sitting up on my on my windshield. Cause that's what I do. So let's go over to um let's go to let's see, downstairs would be Nordstrom's rack first. And maybe so if you guys had a choice, and I bet you're gonna say the the tote style, would you get the long shop pillage pillage? tote in chalk because they have that one it's like ten dollars more i think which is whatever or they have this same exact backpack in the chalk which i love as well now i was going to exchange it for the backpack style if even if they'll let me i don't even know because i don't have my receipt but the tags are still attached um so what would you guys do would you get the backpack or the tote? I'm thinking 99.99% of you are going to say the tote. That's what I'm thinking. And I'm using my beautiful LV on the go right now because I'm always on the go. Let me show you. Holds everything and more. Come here, LV on the go. It's actually way too full. I've got it crammed because I need to do a clean out. Let's see. I need to clean out my bag super bad. Okay, you guys, so really nothing to talk about right now, so I'll see you at the scene. Okay, you guys, we are at Norson's Rock. Um, I think that's pretty. Let me see if I can find the long shops that they might have all sold out. I don't know, I saw them here a couple days ago. So we'll see. And I'm gonna have to be careful because there's some Decent background music playing in the background. Hmm, I don't see any of them. A lot, a lot of bags here though today. Kind of take you a little short walk through here. All right. Oh wait, here they are up here. Okay, so this is, I don't see the backpack, but they do have the tote. I love this color so much. Let me hang it here for you. That color is so adorable with a little black horse on it. Isn't it cute? I know it's gonna get filthy, but that's what washing machines are for, so it's 99. And then, um, so they've got three more of the little totes left. I don't see the backpack anymore. Let's find the coolest one, which I don't know, I think I might have got the tote. Let me see if I see any of the backpacks anywhere. Okay, here we go. Here's a bunch of stuff down here. All the long shots down here. So they've got this blue. They've got a tote like mine. They've got the red backpack. More, a lot of these little, oh, here's a little tiny, um, like a hand held one, like a little small. There's a mauve color. And there's a gray, a light gray. Tote. And let's see what else do they have in here. Another gray. And oops. A 
another little um, handbag one. I like the larger one though. This one that I picked out. I like this size a lot. So I'm gonna go see if they will exchange. This is a cute Madewell leather tote. They had this one that sell at Ontario Mills for like $45. Um, let me put these down and I'll see what they are here. Let's see if it's on sale or not. The only problem with this, you guys, hair on hide is on the back as well. And when you wear it next to your body, it will all eventually start balding and it's not a pretty thing. And uh, it is, yeah, it's on sale here for $42. I mean, the tote is adorable and it comes with a crossbody strap. Ooh, that's a pretty leather bag right there. Let's see what's up here. Yes. Here's a Rebecca Minka for one twenty. What? How do you get that? My pile. All right. Let's see what we can find out here. I just sold this exact bag. I think $75 somebody bought it for me and look how much it is. $249 and that's half off of $500. So you guys want to shop with me because I get the deals, okay? Of course mine was True Love, but it's the same exact bag. And I think I sold it for $75. Bucks. Looks just exactly, it is this exact bag. So. You might want to subscribe for some bomb deals, I'm telling you. If you haven't already, if you don't know, I am a reseller and I thrift all my items, most all of them, and then, yeah, resell them. Oh, here's a Longchamp backpack in black. Oh, I kind of like that one. Hmm, that's an idea because I do like the black a lot. What? 55 bucks? Are you kidding me? Something's wrong here. Because they're like 90 something. Okay, that might have to happen. I gotta try it on. Oh, I'm gonna keep looking. See what we can find here. Maybe some more killer deals hiding out here. And then, of course, like there's the sale table. This is a really cute with sports sack I've had my eye on for a little while. It's so girly and fun. I like that one. I'm all about the color, you guys. Love it. Oh, okay. I already saw this color though. This is a long shunt in that really pretty blue color. You know, I think the price is less because that one is like the club design, and then this one does not have the club design on it. I need to open it up though. This is driving me nuts. Hang on. Okay, let's see here. Okay, so here's the backpack opened up. It's a nice medium to large -ish size, and then there's this tote. So it's between these two, which one I'm going to get if they'll exchange it. I guess I should probably go ask before I pick it out, right? So wait and see which one I decide on because I can't make up my mind right now. Put in the comments below which one you guys think I, I'm getting, if, if I'm able to get one. Okay? Okay, bag is purchased. Now we're going upstairs. Purchased, exchange. Now we're going upstairs to... I love you. Hello. Look at first. Hello. <laughs> ah. Anita. Anita, yes, yes. That's that's my friend, you guys. I'm vlogging right now, so watch the video. <laughs> Bye. Oh my god, I so love when you guys run into me. I love it, love it, love it. She's a doll. Anita is amazing. And 
We are coming into Marshalls right now to see what they have. Oh, me and my day, Anita. We gotta go shopping together. I think that would be fun. Hit me up. Okay. So, got the little clippy thing, the little security thing removed off my wallet. Not a problem. And now we'll just go ahead and take you guys around and see. Ooh, super cute. Super cute little sweatshirt cardigan thing. I love that. Love, love. Love all the fall stuff. All right, let's see. What do we have over here in the handbags, you guys? We're just gonna make a quick run through because I know y'all love some handbags, but if I remember correctly, not all of you are digging Marshalls like, like me. Um, yeah, I agree with you. Kind of all plasticky stuff around here. That's pretty. How much are you? Um, 40 bucks. And there's a little, I have this fossil at home for sale. It's in a little metallic gold one. It's super cute. Got that. I got so many wallets at home. It's redonkulous to sell because I keep collecting. Cute little boxier. Like a little tiny camera bag and leather. And it's on clearance for 39. I'm not gonna lie guys, my thrifted finds are a hundred times cuter in my opinion than like all these plastic guys here. Just my opinion though. There's Michael Kors though for 130. This one's actually pretty. What is this? This is a coach for 150. And this is the Bunch of lippies, um, lip oil, Maybelline's Vivid Matte Liquid, kind of cool stuff. Nothing I need right now though. Ooh, that's pretty, whatever it is. Oh, it's a massage roller. I'm like, oh, I love that color. Thought it was maybe like a lip balm or something. I'm a, I'm a dork, I know. Okay, guys, do you guys want to go to maybe Goodwill and look around for a minute? Maybe we'll do that because there's a good vote out here where I am. And we'll see what we can find out there. Guys, I'm super excited. SoCal and see the skies. We are getting ready to get a torrential downpour, which is probably gonna be like a half inch of rain. <laughs> but yeah, I'm excited because there's a chill in the air. It's breezy and the rain is coming. And Lord knows we need it more than anything out here right now because SoCal, we don't get a lot of rain, and when we do, I cherish every freaking drop. So in the little um, shopping center I'm in, there's El Torito, there's a lash bar. I had my lashes done there, and my eyes got extremely in, um, had a, a reaction, which is not good. And I'm just that person who cannot wear uh, extensions. I have no problems wearing the strips with the glue. Not a problem at all. But I've tried, I think, three or four times with the extensions. And it's, it doesn't work. So, all right. I'm almost out my car. So, I'll see you guys at the next Okie dokie pokies. We are at the Goodwill. One of the millions of Goodwills here in SoCal. Here's a coach, a very worn out coach for 40 bucks. Wow. Ooh, slim pickings today, you guys, at this store. Let's go over here and see what there is. One more rack. 
guess. It's dirty. Hmm, this is interesting. I think it's just uh, something from, I don't know. Never seen this one, and there's no name on it, so. Kinda cute though. Well, this might be something. It's genuine leather, and I could totally clean this up really nicely. Who is it by? Let's open it up. Need some inside cleaning. And, oh, it's Hobo International. Really now, let's see. You guys know me and my Hobo International, I really like it. It's got a nice strap on the top. That'll be easily cleaned up. Um, let's see the inside here. Ew, I don't like that. That's too dirty. How much is this thing? I don't see a price on it. Well, it may have to stay here. I don't know, I'll check the price in a minute. Cute little baguette. It's faux leather though, and it's $11.99. Hmm. Okay, so never mind because it's all ripping up. That's a no. Um, Philip Plain leggings. Price here is, let's see. Oh, here it is. $9.99 and let me just show you something real quick. So yeah, that just happened. Wow. You know I'll be wearing these too. Shoot, just put a little white sweatshirt with it or something. Cute. Okay, so here is a little antique shop we're gonna go in. Look at the window, how they have it decorated. It's so cute. I thought those were leather chairs, but they're like a silk sort of material, all fallified. Ooh, that sweater looks so warm and comfy. Hey, everybody. Okay, so let's go in and see what they've got going on in here. really cute little setup so each of these are like um, people individually rent them and they put their specific items in their own little I guess you would call it a booth and yeah they sell their items that way it's on consignment so it's kind of fun once in a great while I'll come around look around and see what kind of neat things they've got one-of-a-kind goodies that they probably thrift as well and then just put in their boutique. Hi ladies and gentlemen. Okay, and I remember I bought a chandelier from here a while back. Couldn't fit in the living room properly and they don't take returns. <laughs> well, of course not. But look, here we go, here's a leather. What do we have here? Oops, be careful. This is a sesame bag it's kind of pretty and they are asking 50 bucks they've got a lot of leather bags oh this one's pretty all vintage stuff this one is 45 little crossbody and what do we have up here if i remember correctly i think this one's burberry yep this is a big burberry satchel um price on this one is 85 it does have a tear right here though, where the strap connects. And then up here is a bunch of bags. I wonder if I can get any of them down to show you. I can tell that's a Betsy Johnson. And that's something plastic. And that is leather. That's a pink Michael Kors. How much do they want for that? $59? Hmm, let's see. It's like brand new. It's pretty good. It's a pretty one. Okay, let's back up here. 
I wish this was smaller and I wish it was not falling apart because I would like to have that myself. Let's see what else. And then there's like all clothes and stuff back here. Aww, so cute. Let's see. Got lots of tchotchkes in this joint. I'm not a tchotchke kind of gal. Um, but if I see something that strikes me, then I am. <laughs> I just don't have like to have a lot of stuff hanging around. See, like they have people have their little bags and their little booths along with all of their tchotchkes. Tinkerbell. This is a, see, I found it hidden back here on Michael Kors, hidden in the depths for $28. Looks like it's missing the crossbody strap though. So you've got to dig deep because you never know what you're going to find. Look at the vintage puppets. Definitely old. Tweety Bird. Oh, I forgot this guy's name. He's from our era though, the 70s. How much? Eight dollars. Oh shoot! Hang him back up here. And then Sylvester the kitty cat. to take in, right you guys? This is pretty. 35. Comes with a little attached, like a little coin charm. I'm trying to see the name of it though. I have to check it and see. Ooh, look at this, you guys. JL. Wallet. Anybody have the initial JL? A vintage leather wallet. Very pretty. With yellow roses on it. So pretty. That belt. Embossed belt, too. You guys, check out this leather puffer jacket. How cool is this thing? I've never seen a leather puffer before. Stand back so you can see it. Hmm, I kind of really like that. This thing is so cool. It's like all worn, faded in spots. I'm not gonna get the puffer jacket because there's like a big water stain on the back by the collar. But I really did like it. it so cute. Never seen anything like it. Ooh, I love that bench. $125. Whoa, that's a huge wicker light.
pretty cool, right guys? Okay, uh, you guys, I am so hungry right now. It is two o'clock in the afternoon and I'm freaking craving a big potato. Of all things, a big potato. So we're gonna go to Wendy's and go through the drive-thru and get a big potato. Okay, so I got those leggings. I'll do this little mini haul and I'll show you what Longchamp happened. And we'll do all of that when we get to Wendy's, which is right down the street. Are you guys having a great day today? Let me switch you around and I can show you, I can show you the weather. Okay, you wanna see where we're going? I'm very much in the mood to stop and look at cars too, but eh, I don't know. I don't know about that. Sorry about the way the phone is placed on the windshield, but you know, if you fall, like I said, if you guys fall, then I will go ahead and turn it off because my darn holder does not work. It just keeps falling off. So, Oop, okay, yep, you fell. So, no such thing as unsafe driving, so I need to go ahead and switch you guys off. I can do this for a minute. A minute, maybe. <laughs> oh, this is a random vlog, right? Okay, you guys, I'll see you when we get to Wendy's. Okay. Fattening and delicious. So I got a potato with cheese. Whoa, it's huge. Holy cow. And I had to add some sour cream to it. So we're just gonna go ahead and have lunch. Oh, first I'm gonna show you before I eat what we got for you guys so you guys can see. I got, okay, so obviously you guys saw I had to get these $2,000 leggings for $9.99 because, right? Look how cute they are. They're so cute just to wear a big slack, big, like a big open oversized hoodie. So whoever uh, this dude is, Philip, Philip Plain, I got your leggings. They're really cute. And I'm gonna wear them. So cool. And then as for the backpack exchange, um, they wouldn't exchange it because I didn't have a receipt. So that's not a problem. Not a problem at all. So this, you guys, is going to still be for sale if anybody wants it. I will list it below this video and we can be twins because, ta-da, I got the black, I love this, the black Longchamp Le Pliage backpack. I really, really like it. I paid um, $54.97 plus tax and yeah, I was like, I just really, really wanted it. And I was like, you know what, Cam, don't do the white. Just don't do the white. Oh. You guys ever had high chews before? I'm talking like one a day, two a day max because they're fattening. These freaking things, I'm brand new to them, so I got them too. This one is watermelon, lemon, and grapefruit, sweet and sour. And then this one is grape, green apple, and strawberry. So I got that. Love this backpack so much. What's the original price on this? I don't not know, but I could find out on the website. So I went ahead and got it. Um, it's got a pocket in here. And like I said, the taupey color one will be for sale. I'll have it listed below if you still want it. You and I can long shop twin. That'd be cool. And then I went into Marshall's and they went ahead and took out the sensor on my wallet. So I'm excited about that. And yeah, let's just go ahead and put all this over here. Get my potato out because I'm starving. Look at it. Oh, what the heck did they give me to drink? I did not order whatever that is. Great. Okay. Yum. Look at that, you guys. On a nice rainy day. Oh, yeah. Okay, you guys, I'm not going to eat on camera because I don't like doing that. So I will see you guys on tomorrow's video. Thanks for joining me today. I hope you enjoyed it. I had a good time having you guys with me and I'll see you on tomorrow's video. Bye guys.